Meghan Markle, what to know everything you need to know about Duchess of Sussex Meghan Markle and her new life as part of the British royal family. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry began the first official tour as a family on Monday, accompanied by the four-month-old son, Archie. However, while many eyes were on the royal's outing, some eagle-eyed observers couldn't help but notice that the Duchess of Sussex forwent her engagement ring for the trip. According to Page Six, the 38-year-old former actress left her three-diamond ring, reportedly valued at around $295,000, a matching eternity band at home, opting instead to wear her gold Welsh wedding band along with another dainty gold ring worth $250. Meghan Markle wears $85 dress during royal tour of Africa. Meghan Markle attends Heritage Day public holiday celebrations in Cape Town Tuesday. Photo by Paul, Samir Hussein, where image Meghan Markle applauds Prince Harry for being the best dad a source told Hello, that Markle stepped out without hurrying because she wants to be low-key while doing meet and greets with the public. Royal expert and writer Daniela Elsa further explained in an article for news.com.au that Meghan's choice to forego this expensive item reflects the inherent tension in being a member of the royal family. That is, you might be a member of an obscenely rich clan, but you are never meant to flaunt that wealth, wrote Elsa, adding that appearing humble is a key job requirement for any working royal, even though you live in a castle and your family has a vault stuffed with priceless jewels. The Queen won't discuss Meghan Markle, Prince Harry, report the very fact Meghan was adroit enough to realize that and quietly left her rock elsewhere, I think, is a powerful signal, added Elsa. Firstly, of just how conscious she is about making others comfortable. Secondly, that she is sensationally savvy image-wise. And third, that she is more than happy to rewrite the rule book. Prince Harry, Duke of Sussex and Meghan, Duchess. If Sussex attend a reception for young people, community and civil society leaders at the residence of the British High Commissioner during the Royal Tour of South Africa on September 24, 2019 in Cape Town, South Africa. Photo by Facundo Ariza Balaga Pool, Getty Images, Get the Fox News app on Tuesday, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex visited South Africa's oldest mosque, the 225-year-old Awel Mosque in Cape Town. The royal couple kicked off the tour on Monday with visits to girls' empowerment projects that teach rights and self-defense. Meghan and Harry's 10-day tour includes scheduled stops in Botswana, Angola and Malawi with a focus on wildlife protection, mental health and mine clearance. Associated Press contributed to this report. Let's blog ads. Why?